Okay. Okay. Oh, my head. What happened? King's honor, friend. Okay, clearly I'm in a video game. Right? This ha this can't be real unless I'm hallucinating. And I'm pretty sure I didn't take anything before I fell asleep. Alright. Hello? Hello? Can you help me? I don't know where I'm at. What did he do? He was supposed to be helping me find information about... Oh, what was I looking for? Oh, why can't I remember? Mm. Well met. Can you help me? Hello? Light be with you. Welcome, Welcome to, to World of Warcraft, Embra. Prepare for adventure beyond imagination. Remember the exclamation points above people's heads indicate they have a quest for you. Happy questing! Oh hell no, I've seen this movie. I am out of here. One of these paths has to lead out of this place. Okay. That's on fire. That's back where I came. That guy just walked through me. What? But he seems to be heading in that direction. Maybe that's where the exit's at. Oh, um, I, I, I have no idea. Okay, but let's just go. Go, go, go. Stop messing around, Ember. You need to just go. Yes, there it is. Huh. What? Is this a wall? Invisible wall? What is happening to me? Oh, what the hell? You've got to be kidding me. Embra, it seems you're not quite ready to leave the starting area. Remember, mystery begins with the basics. Explore, complete quests, and hone your skills. Adventure awaits, but patience is key. Happy adventuring. Fine. Need help? You could say that again. Ugh. Beating them back. So you're the new recruit from Stormwind, eh? I'm Marshal McBride, commander of this garrison. Glad to have you on board. Uh, I guess. McBride looks through some papers. Embra. It is Embra, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. You've arrived just in time. Have I? The Black Rock Orcs have managed to sneak into Northshire through a break in the mountain. My soldiers are doing the best that they can to push them back, but I fear they will be overwhelmed soon. Head northwest into the forest and kill the attacking Black Rock Wargs. Help my soldiers. You... you want me to go kill... dogs. Go honor, friend. Sorry, wargs. The... these vicious things. The things your soldiers just can't seem to do anything against. Sure. Alright, let's take a minute. Okay. Alright, let's think about this. We know we're in a video game. So that means none of this is real. So, technically, I'm not going to be actually farming a dog. Sure, that's gonna. I mean, they really don't seem to be that big of a threat. I mean, like, are your soldiers dull? I mean, uh, I don't even know how to use this crossbow that I have. Oh my god! Ah. Okay. Oh, why is it still warm? Why is it warm? Wait, I thought I was in a video game. Why is this warg warm? That's disconcerting. Okay. It's a video game. It's just a video game. Okay. Sparkly means loot body. Oh, this one's warm too! 
Am I this skilled with a crossbow? I have never shot a crossbow before. Uh. Okay, let's just get through this and get back to this guy. What can I do for you? It's finished. Beating them back. You've bought us a little time, Embra, but we've got even bigger problems to deal with now. Really? For the Alliance. Lions for lambs. The invading orcs aren't fools. Orcs? They are sizing us up, making sure that when they attack it will be to their advantage. Who? In the forest, to the northwest, are black rock spies. Okay. They peer at us through spyglasses, watching our every move, waiting. I want you take the fight to them. Kill the Black Rock spies. Seriously? We must show them that we know they are watching us and that we are prepared. Can't we just, like, talk to them? Be careful. I mean, it seems a bit extreme to just go out and it's, you know what? I'm, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. What do I know? I know nothing. <sighs> All right. Let's go see if I can find some of these orcs. Is is that one? It's like the predator out here. That's kind of cool. Eat you. <laughs> Sir, I think we need to be friends first before that happens. Oh, that's probably not what you meant. That's fine. Oh, this body's warm too. Why is there... It's a video game. It's just... A video game. But it really didn't seem like he was an aggressor. I mean, there's another one sneaking around over there, and I mean, sure, they run after me after I've hit them. I feel like I'm the aggressor here. Am I the bad guy of the story? No. No. These are the bad guys. Right? McBride, my dude, we need to talk. I'm pretty sure that I'm the aggressor in this situation. and We're the bad guys here. Need help? Why are you clapping? Lions for lambs. Excellent work, Embra. You've turned out to be quite an asset to this garrison. Seriously? It's time for you to train. That's not what or I've been doing? Like. Join the battle. I received an urgent message from Sergeant Willem. Willem. Turns out okay. that the Black Rock Orcs have hired goblin assassins. Goblins? They ambushed our battalion behind the abbey. Willem has asked me to send him a hero. You have to go help them, Embra. Do I? Find Sergeant Willem north of the abbey at the command tent. Go. Uh, fine. Light bless you. All right, so we have worgens that are bad, orcs that are bad, and now you're telling me we have goblins that are bad. And so far, everything I have interacted with, I have been the aggressor, so I'm 100% the villain of the story. All right, what's up, dude? I heard you have a How goblin problem. Join the battle. It's true, we were ambushed. I don't dare send any more soldiers out there and risk losing them too. So I need a volunteer. Someone willing to risk their life. Well, I'm not. I mean, I don't want to. Safe travel. They sent assassins. Have you ever seen a goblin, Embra? They're no. wretched little monsters that love only two things, gold and themselves. The Black Rock Orcs have enlisted the aid of goblin assassins to kill our soldiers. If you look to the field in the north you can barely make out their silhouettes sneaking about in the grass i need you to head out there and kill every goblin that you see oh my God. they need to learn that nobody messes with the alliance there's a see you around okay also i'm not sure you need a spyglass to see them i mean i feel like everything's pretty visible within you know what whatever all right what's up yo good day to you Fear no evil. Have you embraced the holy light yet? No. Sister. No. It is through the holy light that we are saved. 
Uh, it is through the holy light that I am able to heal these overly demanding soldiers. Okay. And it is through the holy light that you will be able to venture out into the field to the north and rescue our fallen brothers. Uh, Take this prayer book with you into the field and cast the light's healing touch on the injured. Objectives? You want... See you later. How am I supposed to use a book? You know, you know what? Don't worry about it. I will figure it out. Goblins. Holy light book thing. Hopefully I can get out of here soon. Alright, so that must be a goblin. They don't look too bad. Sneaking around. They're not very invisible. <sighs> Sorry. Sorry about this. He's warm too. Uh, I'm not gonna get used to that. Behold, dude, the book of light. Yeah, sure. All right. Man, they make a lot of noise when they go down. <sighs> Behold the book! Yeah, you're okay. That's the spirit runoff. Is that a face? Oh, what the hell? Oh, no, that's not- who built this? Who did this? Was this the goblins? The orcs? I'm convinced that was that dude up front. Talking about his holy light. He came out here and did this. This is his doing. <laughs> I think I'm going insane. <laughs> I want to cry. Okay. Let's see here. So I just need a couple of more goblins. And a couple more dudes hit with a book. Behold! The book. Yeah! 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 Try dodging next time, huh? <sighs> so far this isn't that bad, alright? You know... It's not bad. It's gonna be fine. Go hit this guy in the face with a book of light. Shazam! Yeah, you're okay. That's right. You go, champ. What the hell is this? What are you? You're like a... rat... creature... dude... thing. Hello? What are you? I don't want your candle. Ow! What? What? Ah! This hurts, this hurts, this hurts. Dude, just cast. Did you just throw fire at me? What the hell? What just happened? Okay, he was the aggressor in this. I wasn't gonna steal his candle, but. Here we are. I have no idea what this is. But let's just get out of here. All right, dude, I'm done hitting people in the face with Fear no book. evil. I think you now understand the power of the light. No, I understand the, the power hope, of this book. Sister and the light taketh from the darkness. Don't call me Bless sister. Bless be the light. Have a good one. No, I'm not buying what you're selling. Other dude. The goblin. Hey there. They sent assassins. That will teach those monsters. They're They'll think really twice monsters, before taking another short. mercenary job for orcs. I'm Safe travel. The rear is clear. Excellent I'm work. I'm sorry. Embra. Excuse me. <laughs> the rear is now officially clear. Okay. We'll take care of the stragglers. I want you to go back to Marshal McBride. 
standing in front of Northshire Abbey, yeah, south know. of here, I'm sure and he let him know moved. that the goblin situation is under control. Is it under control? Farewell, Hunter. Uh, see you around. Yeah. I'm pretty sure me going after a few of these goblins did nothing, but... What yeah. Do you do you? Uh, yeah. No, no, it's fine. It's fine. Dude, Please. I just got attacked by a rat goblin thing. The rear is clear. With your help, we have managed to secure the northern and western sectors of Northshire. Okay. We still have a rather large contingency of Black Rock orcs to the east, and they've begun burning down the forest. Why? Be careful. Black Rock invasion. The orcs have begun burning down the forest, Embra. They have taken over the vineyard to the east and are planning their final assault against us. They must be stopped. Head east, across the river, and kill the rampaging Black Rock orcs. Collect their weapons as proof of their demise and return to me. You're our only hope, Embra. What? Okay. Light bless you. That seems, that's a bit aggressive, but I mean, so far nothing has not been aggressive, so. Oh, now this lady wants to talk to me. Okay. What do you have to say for yourself? Hey there. Extinguishing hope. Times like these make me long for when the Defias were still around. The, the cataclysm has opened a pathway from the burning steppes and now Black Rock orcs pour into Northshire Valley. They have Cattle taken way. over my vineyard and are burning it to the ground. To the ground. Please, Embera, that vineyard is all I have. Take my fire extinguisher and extinguish the flames at the vineyard. There still might be hope for that land. Have a good one. Oh, sweet, I'm a firefighter now. Do I need to get certified for, th you know, whatever. Ooh, wait. You're a hunter trainer. Hello? Good day to you. Are you here to train, hunter? I'm here for answers. Can you help me? Hello? Ashley? This is a name above your head, but I mean, hello? Safe travels. Yeah. Sure. Hell, they really did set everything on fire. But why? I mean, this river would protect everything from burning on the other side. You know what? I shouldn't try to find logic in this. It's fine. I just got to boop these guys as Snoop, collect their weapons, and just be done with this. This one seemed a little bit more aggressive. Still warm body. <sighs> yeah, I get the feeling these guys are gonna be like that rat dude thing. And they're just gonna come after me. So if I just keep going, then this should end up being pretty easy to do. Whoops, that. What is that sound? Um, is that me? I th I think that's on me. What is that? Oh, it it's my spell book. What is going on in here? Oh, I have information to learn what what is it that i can learn in here hmm pet utility beast lore tame beast wait are you telling me that i can tame something and have it run around with me oh you know what orcs i'll be right back hold on i wonder i wonder if i can end up taming one of these worgen dog things, warg, wargs, wargs, wolves, puppers, whatever. I wonder if I can end up having one of these be my companions to help. I mean, I'm not known as a Disney princess here, but 
um, how hard could it be to tame a wild creature and have it come along with me on adventures? I might as well make the best of this. I mean, I'm stuck here. I might as well just make the best of this whole entire situation. All right, let's see. The book said something about beast lore, so let's do that first. What does it say? Black Rock Warg. Specialization, ferocity. Tamed ability is bite, fierce bite, growl, and dash, and his diet is meat. All right, you are now going to become my best friend. Ow! Yay! I got a wolf. Sweet. Pet, pet, pet. <laughs> All right, you. We have some orcs that we got to go take care of because they have some grievance against the process of making wine, apparently. All right. Couple more fires, couple more orcs, and we are done. The dude's trying to set himself on fire. Oh, there's one behind the fire. Good job, puppers. Let's do another. Nice. Good job. I don't think I'm ever going to get over the fact that these bodies are warm, but whatever. Alright, we just got to put out one more fire and we are done. We have to be close to getting out of the starting zone. Right? Boy, I sure hope they don't freak out about the fact that you're walking around with me. Because they seem to have some sort of grievance. So just play it cool. I'll protect you if they try to go after you, right? You're my puppers. No one seems to be reacting to it. Weird. Alright. How are you? Fine. Extinguishing hope. Bless your heart, Embra. You truly are a hero of the Alliance. No, I'm not. Though the land is completely incinerated and there is nothing left of the vineyard but ash and debris, I still might be able to recover. Right? Sure. How bad can it be? That's the spirit. Never give up. See you around. Yup. Not if I can help it. All right. Need help? Black Rock Invasion. Have you killed the rampaging orc hordes? Some of them. Go with honor, friend. Black Rock Invasion. Wow, that was some the energy. The Black Rock orcs will surely fall now that their main force has been defeated. Only one task remains. Oh, of course. For the Alliance. Ending the invasion. The rampaging orc horde is led by a savage beast known as Kurtok the Slayer. Okay. Kurtok is responsible for the recent invasion and must be killed if we are to have peace in the valley. Okay. Venture back east, across the river and through the vineyard, and look for the passage leading into the mountains. Alright. Kurtok will be there, preparing for another assault. Okay. Kill him and return to me. Um... Go with honor, friend. Sure. All right, puppers, you heard the man. We There is more killing to be at hand. Let's go. Well, that must be the dude. He looks different than the rest of them, so... Are you ready for this, puppers? I'm gonna have to come up with a name for you. But are you ready? Let's do this. Whoa. You kind of were no help there, but A for effort. Still a good boy. All right. Now, I mean, I've killed everything that's here, so this has to be the last guy, right? Well met. Ending the invasion. With Kurtok slain, we are safe once again from the orcish hordes. I will send peasants to the pass in an attempt to seal the passage so that no more orcs may come through into our territory. You have the thanks of Stormwind and of the Alliance, hero. Yeah, sure. I'll take a new crossbow. The Alliance. Report to Goldshire. Embra, Where's you that? are a hunter with proven interest in the security of Northshire. Sure. You are now tasked with the protection of the surrounding Elwyn Forest. Mm. If you accept this duty, 
Then I have prepared papers that must be delivered to Marshal Duggan in Goldshire. Okay. Goldshire lies along the southern road, past the border gates. <gasps> yes, please, I'll take that. Yes, 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 yes. Light bless you. All right, dude, I'm off. I would say it's been a pleasure, but I have a splitting headache and I am very confused. Congratulations, Embra. You've completed the starting zone. Now the world of Azeroth lies open before you. Remember, adventure has only just begun. Safe travels and may fortune favor your path. Thanks, random announcement voice in the sky. Ugh. Man, I hope I can figure out how to get out of this place soon. All right, here we are, puppers. Last time you missed it, I got shoved right back where I started, so fingers crossed. Okay. Yes, we are through. Yes. Perfect. Hello. Hello. Rest and relaxation. Every adventurer should rest when exhaustion sets in. And Why there is no finer place to get rest and relaxation than at the Lion's Pride Inn. Why are you sparkling? My best friend, Innkeeper Farley, runs the Lion's Pride. If you tell him I sent you, he may give you the special discounted rates on food and drink. Ooh, food. To find the Lion's Pride Inn, travel south along the road from here you can't miss it. I am a little hungry but I'm more concerned with the fact that you're sparkling, but whatever. See you around. All right. Let's just get there. Embra. Embra. Over here. Over here, Embra. Come to me. Now I know horror movie 101. I shouldn't go to the voice that is calling my name, but at this point, you know what? It's daytime. It's a random cabin in the woods, though. But it it can't be that bad, right? I mean, it looks pretty well lit. I mean, there's a squirrel. Right? Right, puppers? Right? You'll protect me if something weird happens. I mean, is that a cat? Okay, cats, cats are good, right? I just can't seem to find what I'm looking for anymore. Uh, excuse me? Are you okay? Oh! Another soul. You with the curious eyes. Come closer, child. Me? Lost? I, I guess you could say that. Lost? Yes, lost. Lost like a leaf in the storm, like a fish out of water, but fear not, for I have seen it all, child, seen it all. Seen what exactly? The secrets of this realm, the whispers in the shadows, the dance of destiny. But hush now, hush. There's danger here, danger. Danger? What kind of danger? All oh, the worst kind, my dear. Monsters lurk in the dark. Players with dark hearts quests leading to perilous paths. You must be vigilant, vigilant. Right, got it. So what should I do? The storm wind, child! To the heart of Old Town, where the secrets lie and saviors wait. Seek out the one who knows, the one who sees beyond the veil. The one who knows? Who is that? <laughs> ah, that's for you to find out, my dear. But remember, trust no one. Trust no one but yourself. Right, Stormwind, is it? Thank you. I think. Go, child, go! Avenger awaits destiny calls. And remember, beware the shadows. <laughs> I will. Thank you. <laughs> Safe travels, Embra. Safe travels. <laughs> well, that's creepy. All right. 
Stormwind. I gotta go to Stormwind. Whatever we do, we got to go to Stormwind. Light be with you. I think this is the guy ACH, we're looking for. It's hard enough keeping order around here without all these new troubles popping up. I hope you have good news, Embra. Be careful. Report to Goldshire. You have word from McBride? Northshire is a garden compared to Elwyn Forest, but I wonder what Marshall McBride has to report. Here, let me have his papers. Go with go. honor, friend. Report to Goldshire. Well, it says here that you've been awarded acting deputy status with the Stormwind Marshals. Have I? Congratulations. Yeah. And good luck. Thanks. Keeping Elwyn safe is no picnic. Okay. What with most the army busy doing who knows what for who knows which noble. It's hard to keep track of politics in these dark days. Dude, don't even get me started on politics. Light bless you. Um, you're sparkling, but I got a or destiny with storm wind. So, um, I'll catch you on the flip side. Stay frosty, dude. How are you? Tired. Welcome to my inn, weary traveler. What can I do for you? I don't know. See you later. Rest and relaxation. Rest and relaxation for the tired and cold, that's our motto. Please, take a seat by the fire and rest your weary bones. Would you like to try a sampling of some of our fine food and drink? Yes, I want some food. What have do you have? One. Wait, what other things can I learn from you? Hold on. You need something? Yes. Can tell me about When this. you stay at an inn, you rest very comfortably. Because of this, you will become well rested much more quickly than you would in the wilderness. When you are well rested, you learn more from experience. You may also speak with any innkeeper to get a hearthstone, and can later use the hearthstone in order to quickly return to that inn. Okay. Safe travels. You know what, I, I think only the I goods. would be very interested in doing that. Sure. Have a good one. Whoa. Okay. Well, I'm hoping I don't have to come back here, but, you know, thanks. Uh, let me go talk to some other people to figure out where exactly Stormwind is at. Hello? Alright, what do you got for me? Greetings. I'm sorry. I'm a bit busy right now making horseshoes for Werner Osgood in Lakeshire. You're sparkling, dude. Just talk to me, man. See you around. A oh. swift message. Okay. Although we don't get much aid from Stormwind directly, I do have a contact in the city who helps supply us with armor. Perfect. His name is Osric Strang. Okay. His shop, Limited Immunity, is in the old town of Stormwind. Yeah, I have to go Our there. That's perfect. Our supply of armor dwindles, and okay. I must contact Osric for more. Okay. Can you take him this note? Yes. The fastest way to Stormwind is through Bartlett the Brave, okay. our Griffin Master. Your what, Master? He's just outside of the smithy. Bring him my note, and then take a Griffin to Stormwind. Take a what to Stormwind? For the Alliance. Uh. Okay. I I don't know what a Griffin is, but all right. Come on, puppers. He said he's just outside. Are those eagles? What are these? Oh, dude, man, their beaks are so big they'd rip your head off. How are you? Not okay. A swift message. You look like you're in a hurry. Yes. Well, then you came to the right place. Okay. Did I? I don't really know. I mean... See you around. A swift message. You have to get this note to Stormwind. Yes, I need That's to get to Stormwind. That's not a problem. Okay. You can take one of my griffins. What? Safe travels. One of these monster things. Ah, f I guess this is Stormwind, little puppers. Hopefully can we can find who we're looking for. I mean, I know... I know. It was a long walk. I will not get on a griffin. I, you know, I don't care. This, this might be, you know, is it raining? 
Ah, oh, this day couldn't get any worse. Now, what did that lady say I needed to do? I needed to go to Old Town? Uh. Well, come on. Let's see if we can find that. And this area of town seems much busier. Now, how am I supposed to know who's real and who's not? Okay, Mage Quarters, Old Town. All right. Let's go. Like, that person looks different, but I don't know if they're real or not. Hopefully this person can help us, whoever they are. Let's see. Old Town. All right. I guess this way. Fresh bread. Oh, that reminds me I'm hungry. All right, old town. That was weird. Did you see that puffer? That guy looked at me. No, it's all in my head. Now where do I go? I don't know. I guess I'll just kind of look around until I end up finding something. See, that guy didn't look at me. I don't know. I think I'm being paranoid at this point. said to head to the center of Old Town, right? Well, this kind of looks like the center of this area. Okay, motorcycles exist. Uh, good thing I'm not afraid of rats. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's go in here and see if we have any luck with the people inside the shop, perhaps. Everybody else just kind of seems like they're standing around. Hello? Um. Hi. I, I was seeing if maybe you could help me. I'm looking for someone. I don't know their name, but I was told to come here what to can try I do to for find you? somebody. Hey there. Uh, hello? Speak quietly and with great care. The wrong word in these parts could get your throat cut. What? Now, what is it you need from me? I'm, I'm looking for... Speak quietly and with great care. Oh. oh. Safe travels. You're one of the NPCs, aren't you? Mm-hmm. Okay, you're obviously not who I'm looking for. What do I do now? Lost, are we? What? Did that guy just talk to me? Wait! Ho hold on, hold on. Wait! Oh. Just follow me. Oh. Alright. So are you the guy the cat lady told me to find? I need help. I don't know how I got here, but I need to get out of the game. Do you even remember what you were looking for? Looking for? I... I can't quite remember. It's, it's a bit fuzzy. Look, I just want to find a way out. Will you help me? Have you thought that being here perhaps is an opportunity? A chance to prove yourself? 
What opportunity? Look, I just want to leave. How do I do that? The only way out is to win the game. You have to complete it. Win the game? Is that it? Is that hard to do? Can you give me some specific... Sup, sup, give me something that will help me, please. I'm, I'm desperate here. Well, let's see. First, you should only trust me because people here, well, they will lie to you. And they have their own motives for what they do. Does that mean I shouldn't trust you? Just look around Stormwind and you might find your answers. And one more thing. Stop walking everywhere. It looks dumb and makes you stand out too much. Wait, what? What kind of advice is that? Hey! Where are you going? <sighs> I wonder if I can honestly find anything for the splitting headache in this stupid town. Alright, Powers, let's, let's just get out of the rain and we'll assess the situation. I don't think this rain's gonna let up. Oh wait, he's back! Hey! Look, you and I need to have a conversation. You gotta give me a lot more than just travel across Stormwind to find my answers. You are kind of a brat, aren't you? This is gonna be fun. Ooh, who? What? I've never so strongly wanted to punch somebody. There's no point in just standing here. Look, no. No, 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 no. You... Oi! You, dude. Wait, you gotta give me more, okay? You, you've gotta tell me more. Okay, first off, what is your name? Let's start with that basic, basic stuff. What is your name? I go by Bloodthirst, but you can call me Thirst, Embera. How do you know my name? You would be surprised by the amount of things I know about you. Is that a fact? Well, I know you are stuck here like a lot of other people. Wait, there's more people here that are stuck? They are not your problem, though. I already told you that you need to look around here, find a quiet place, and look at your adventure book. It will give you more information, so use that as your guide. Once you are done, use your hearthstone to take you back to Goldshire. Then, you can work on winning the game and getting out of here. Adventure guide? Look around, hearthstone. Got it. There is a tavern up ahead called the Pig and Whistle, where you can get some food and get started. Don't miss me too much, princess. This guy... <laughs> Don't be upset. He gave you good information. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Alright, little puppers. Let's go in here, grab something to eat. I am starving, and let's get this started. Am I really this short? These seats are huge. All right, so it looks like we got a spell book, and it gives me information about the things that I have learned how to do. We have a professions tab. Okay, so it looks like I can learn a first and a second profession. I can learn cooking, fishing, archaeology. I can be an archaeologist without a degree. I mean, okay, that's a positive. That is definitely a positive. Fishing is kind of not my favorite thing to do, but cooking? Cooking equals I can make food for myself, so we don't know how long this is going to take. I'm hoping, I'm hoping I can get out of this before too long, but professions might be helpful. 
Hmm, we're gonna have to figure out exactly what we're gonna need to do, because making money, I think I'm gonna need that, because money equals food and lodging. Hmm. Hey, look, little one, you got a tab. Oh, it tells me all about the things that you can do. Hmm. All right. All right. All right, let's grab something to eat. I have to admit, this is honestly the weirdest thing to be eating something, knowing that it's not real, but yet it tastes delicious. The food here has no business being this delicious. Mm. All right. So from what I was reading, puppers, I can actually give you a name other than what you are just called wolf. So let's think of something clever that we could end up naming you. That way you sound intimidating and people kind of just leave us alone. Right? Uh, there's a giant rat. You know what? Maybe it's a pet. We're just going to ignore that. There's rats all over this place. All right. Wolf. Hmm. I think I'm going to give you a cool name. Let's call you... Mm. How about... War. That seems like something really intimidating. Just be like, war, attack. I mean, I feel like that rat's more... You know what? That's... Yes. All right. You are my little baby boo. All right, war. We got some professions to learn. So let's go ahead and get started. And see if we can find... Hmm... Actually, there's a kitchen here, right? Maybe the guy in here can teach us how to cook. Well, it does say cooking trainer. All right. You Hello? need something? Do I look like I have the time or energy to coddle every tourist that wanders through my door? Tell me what you need and make it quick. Can you train me on how to cook? What? Let's go. See you later. That that's it? Now I just have the knowledge of these recipes? All right, that's pretty cool. All right, it looks like I can make a couple of things for food. Hmm. What's this one called spice bread? You know what? Bread is really good. So let's make a whole bunch of bread and we'll just fill up our bags full of bread. And that'll be what we walk around with. All right. So just wiggle my hands, bread. So it's like magic. Okay, so I just get the ingredients I need for it, wave my hands around menacingly in front of a flame and bam, I have bread. Yeah, no, that makes perfect sense. All right, now let's go see what else we can figure out what to do. Hi, Thirst. How's it going? Do you miss me already? <laughs> what a jerk. All right, let's see here. Feels weird to run everywhere, but I mean, I guess this is the center. Didn't I see that person earlier? You know what? Don't think about it. Okay, so we have a bank. We got a trading hall. Alright, let's see if we can figure out... Uh, these people look like they might be able to train me. Hello? Good day to you. Hey. Welcome to Stormwind. Thanks. Took a long time to rebuild her, but it was well worth it. Rebuild her from so where? are you visiting, or are you here on business? Dude, I'm stuck. But can you train me how to fish? Have a good Just one. like that, I have the knowledge of fishing. Cool beans. Alright, what's next? Um... 
I think I was reading the thing and herbalism is something I can do so I could pick flowers. That seems really easy. Let's do that. Elun Adore. Hi. I hope that your interruption is for a good cause. I was in the middle of some important work. Um, yeah, I was just wondering if you could train me on how to pick flowers, because apparently you need training for that. Cool beans, Farewell. thank you. Uh, bye? That was so quick. Ooh. Hello. Don't get distracted. Travel through storm wind. I was told that this is an important place to go to. Oh. So this was the old king. Why does being here make me feel so sad? I didn't know you. But I hope you rest peacefully. Alright, let's go back to the pig and whistle and evaluate our situation. Alright, war. So we've learned how to cook, we've learned how to fish, and we have learned how to pick flowers. Granted, it's not everything. I think that's going to end up doing it for now. Now, what did what did Thurst say that I needed to do? I needed to use my hearthstone. That'll take me quicker back to Goldshire, which I guess beats walking. So, here goes nothing. Hearthstone, take me home. God, the room is spinning. I think I'm gonna puke. I don't know why you just didn't warn me, War, that eating before hearthing was gonna end up making me sick for two days. It's a good thing you're adorable puppers. Thanks for keeping me company, War. I guess it wasn't all for naught. I ended up looking more into everything and it looks like I'm missing my interface. Like, I'm supposed to be able to see a lot more than what I'm able to see, so if I press this button, this should end up resetting everything to where I'm actually able to see what's going on. Alright, here it goes. Please stand by. System resetting. the hell was that? Why was it so loud? <laughs> oh sweet look we have everything war. <laughs> I don't even know I want to cry. Am I laughing because it's funny or am I just actually losing all of my uh... okay <laughs> I'm going insane. All right what was it that there said I had to do? I had to win the game. All right. So let's go back. I mean, how hard could this be? I mean, we do a few quests, we save a few people. It's gonna be fine, right? All right, William, I'm shiny and new. Let's get this started. Hey what do you got for me? Cobalt candles. Hello, my lady. Hi. Hello. Do you have a moment? Yeah. My brother and I run an apothecary in Stormwind, and I'm here to gather large candles for their wax. Okay. Can you help me? Yeah, sure. You can get large candles from kobolds, and I hear rumors that kobolds are infesting the Elwyn mines, the Fargo Deep mine to the south and Jasper Lode mine to the east. I suggest looking for candles in one of those places. Kobolds? What are those? Have a good one. Uh, yeah, you too. I'm not really sure what these are, but I mean, if they got candles, I guess I can go get their... You want me to murder them, don't you? Yeah. It's not gonna be me asking. Whatever. Alright. Come on, war. Alright, Marshall. Might be with you. What do you got? Be careful. ACH. It's hard enough keep... The Fargo Deep Mine. 
Okay. The mine in Northshire isn't the only one with problems. Okay. I have reports that the Fargo Deep Mine in Elwyn has also become a haven for cobalts. Okay. Explore the mine and confirm these reports, then return to me. Okay. The mine is almost due south of Goldshire, between the Stonefield and McClure homesteads. Alright. I guess I'm going into a mine. Go with honor, friend. What else do you have for me? What is this? Hmm. Light bless you. Heroes call, Westfall. Westfall has fallen to hard times, friend. Okay. okay. With the threat of the Defias extinguished, the region has become a haven for the homeless and downtrodden. Who's the Defias? The crime rate of the area has skyrocketed as people fight for shelter and food. Okay. Now I hear tale of murder. What? If you are interested in helping the people of the Alliance, Westfall would be a great place to start. Report okay. to Lieutenant Horatio Lane at the Jansen Stead. You'll find Westfall directly west of Elwyn Forest. You mean like the Horatio dude from like CSI Miami? Or the Alliance. Yeah! Guy. No? That's fine. Well, War, it looks like we're going into some mines. Good thing I like watching that kind of stuff, or I guess I used to. Gotta love me some action adventure twins going into mines and wondering why... Do I need, like, a CO2 meter? Is that a thing? Do I need to worry? Mm, that's a future me problem. Hello? What can I do for you? See you around. A fishy peril. Oh, Embra, hi. There's a new threat in Elwyn Forest. How do you know my name? Murlocs are swimming up the streams of eastern Elwyn, a what? scaring away fish and attacking gentlefolk. What's a murloc? I warned Marshal Dugan, but he's more worried about the gnolls and the bandits. The he's gnoll? not convinced that the murlocs are a danger. Please, Embra, speak to Dugan and persuade him to send more troops to the east. What's a murloc? What's a Safe gnoll? Travels. What? Gold uh, dust exchange. What? The cobalts in these parts sometimes carry gold dust on them. Cobalt. I could really use the stuff. Bring me a load of it and I'll give you the best price in town. Best price in town. Like you can to find cobalts in the Fargo Deep Mine to the I south and around the Jasper Load Mine to the northeast. Okay. See you later. Knolls, Murlocs, Cobalts. <sighs> All right, at least now I actually have a quest tracker so I can see what I'm up to. Oh. All right, well, let's see if we can convince this guy how dangerous a murloc is, even though I'm not really sure what that is. Hello. Well met. Hi. Light bless you. A fishy peril. Yes, I spoke with Remy. I respect him as a merchant. Though all reports of murlocs to the east have been sketchy at best. Okay. Your concerns are noted, but unless I receive a military report of a murloc threat, we can't afford to send more troops east. Okay, so we're not Go gonna honor, address this? Further concerns. If you are concerned that the rumors of murlocs are true, not then really. do this travel to the eastern Elwyn Bridge and speak with Guard Thomas. Okay. He has been stationed at the bridge for the past week and will know the state of the area. Like I have here a Stormwind Charger that will take you to guard Thomas. A what? Let me know if you wish to make use of the horse. Oh, a uh, Charger is a horse. Oh, um... For the Alliance. No, that, that, that's okay. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna head on out and find me some, some cobalts in a mine. I gotta get some candles and some gold dust. These people have weird issues. Alright, War. Let's take a gander at the map and see exactly where we're gonna need to end up going. Pretty sure it's this direction, but I don't think there's a path. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's a path anywhere, so... I guess we'll just go ahead and wander into the grass. Hopefully they don't care that I do that. And we shall see what kind of adventures we can have. Because we're going to make the best of this. Alright, War said I look dumb walking, so I guess I'm going to be running. Luckily I don't feel really winded. Like, I know it's a video game. I, I get that, but man, to have this level of cardio in real life. Oof. 
It'd be unstoppable. All right, what do we got out here? It's quite pretty, actually. We got a boar. Doing his little pig thing. That looks like a giant spider in the distance. No one told me this game had spiders. <laughs> They're not real. They can't hurt you. They're not real. They can't hurt you. They're not real. They cannot hurt you. Can they hurt me? I you know what? Let's not find out. Let's do this war. Are you ready? That thing ran fast. Oh, it's huge. Oh. You. <laughs> Why is it kind of slimy? Let's not think about it. Let's just... Let's just not think about it. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Hey, some flowers. All right. Peace bloom. Oh. Picking flowers gives me experience. Ooh. Hunter's mark. Okay. Oh, that's a lot of text. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Okay, yeah. Of course I'm reading it. Don't look at me like that, War. I'm paying attention. It does stuff. It marks things. Yeah, we'll worry about this later. All right, so we don't have to worry about the boar. It's not going to hurt me. Ah, so this is a kobold. You must be kobold. I... Oh, I do have... Oh... I'm going to take your pants, okay? <laughs> I'm going insane. <sighs> well, that must be the mine down there on the left. All right, well, these are the kind of things I got to attack, so... Oh! I one-shot that guy! Did you see that war? Okay, and he has gold dust on him, too. Okay. All right, so let's just make our way down to the mine and get in there and do what we need to do. Hmm. This guy has a different name and a star? Hmm. I wonder if this makes him special or something. Matt, he has about the same amount of stuff everybody else has on them, so I'm not really sure. And I'm not really sure why I'm stealing everybody's pants. I can't be? Oh no. <laughs> uh, I am going insane. It's confirmed. I'm out here in the middle of some sort of mine, ran completely overrun by things called kobolds. They're giant rats with candles on their head and they wear pants. I'm stealing their candles. I'm stealing their cold gold dust. I'm talking to myself. No, I'm talking to War, but War's not real. Is he real? I think he's... <sighs> this is starting to actually get a little bit confusing. None of this is real. Right? Um... Well, I've never actually been in a cave in real life. This is kind of scary. I don't really like it in here, War. Let's make this quick. All right, we've scouted through the mine. We just need a couple more of the gold dust. Let me get out of here.
one more war, and then we're out. Got a war? Oh. This is getting a little bit more challenging. Alright, that's our last gold. Let's get out of here. And let's get back. I don't think we lost war, but did we come past this? This lady has a blue exclamation point over her head. What does that mean? In battle? Ooh, I love snakes. I used to have a snake that lived outside. It's an outside snake. It was a garden snake and I named him Sir Hiss. It's the best snake I think I have ever came across. Gorgeous. Huh, this guy has a blue question mark? Um, you need something? I don't know. Give Gerard a drink. Okay. Farming is thirsty work, and I'm always looking for refreshing spring water. If you have any, then I'm willing to make a trade. Okay. Uh, I think I have some, yeah, actually. Give Gerard a drink. Thanks, Embra. And come back if you want to trade again. Oh, okay, so I give you water, you give me a shiny red apple. Fun fact, I'm allergic to apples. How dumb is that? I wonder if I'm allergic to apples in-game, though. I mean, this isn't real, right? So I shouldn't have an issue? I'm feeling pretty okay. Now yeah, we'll know in a little bit if this was a bad life choice. Oh yeah, we're way off point from where we need to go. Alright. Enough dilly-dallying, War. Let's get back up to where we need to go. Okay, wait. I actually see some people out there. Let's see what's going on with these guys. Hello? What can I do for you? Ah, you just sell drinks and stuff. You know, that guy's really thirsty. You could just give him Have some of your one. water and he'll give you an apple. Hello, Pa? Hello, Mabel? Hello. Young lovers. Oh. Oh, I'm cursed. Oh. My heart belongs to Tommy Joe Stonefield. Okay. But our families are bitter enemies. Oh. So I can't see him, even though my eyes ache to gaze upon that handsome face. Oh. Please, take this letter and give it to Tommy Joe. He's usually at the river to the west of the Stonefield farm, which is due west of here. Okay. Ooh, a little love story. Oh. See you later. <laughs> alright, alright, I'll bite. Okay. So it's a family feud of farmers. Interesting. Alright, so she said he's where? Oh, he's way over there. Hmm. Alright, well, let's head... Hmm. Do I want to head to him? Or do I want to head back into town? What do you think? I see a, a bear. Wasn't that a thing that just happened? You know, whether a woman would want to be alone in the woods with a bear or a man. What a weird thing to have to choose between. <laughs> Alright. So as long as I keep an eye peeper on my map, I'll be able to see flowers and stuff. And that one's next to a bear, and I don't feel like going against a bear, do I? No. 
No. I mean, I can just like go around. It'll be fine. Okay, some more peace bloom. I wonder how much I can end up selling these flowers for. Well, mm, he's not that far away to deliver this love letter, or I could head back into town. Mm. Screw it. Let's do the love letter. Young love stops at nothing. Or I guess it stops at me, because if I don't dis deliver this letter, then... He will never know how much she misses him. Oh, so this hinges on me. Hmm. Well, this looks like it is the place. And we got some quests here, too. Nice. Alright, who do we talk to first? Eeny meeny. Need help? Hi. Princess must die. Who? The Brackwells have a prize winning pig. Oh. Princess. Oh. The sow is huge. And she got that way from sneaking over here and eating my veggies. You it just so happens that she's here now. Put up a fence? Princess must die. Why? Bring me her collar as proof of the deed and I'll give you something for your time. <laughs> You'll find Princess smack dab in the middle of our watermelon patch. It. Get her. It seems a bit excessive. Safe you could just like, I don't know, if she has a collar that means she's domesticated, you could just relocate her. Or, you know, build a complete fence. Sure. Everything has to die now. Yeah. It's fine. It's fine. Hello. Good day to you. Hi. Lost necklace. Okay. I lost my necklace and I think that gutter snipe Billy McClure took it. <laughs> what, a gutter He's usually <laughs> scuttling like a rat around the McClure vineyards east of here. Oh my god. Get my necklace back for me and you'll warm an old widow's heart. Wow, you really must save travels. Gutter snipe. <laughs> Wow, these ladies are intense. Grandma. Hi, Grandma. Huh, it's cozy in here. Alright, war. Looks like we're gonna... It's fine. Eh, we'll, we'll get to Princess eventually. We'll get there. Who's this dude over here? Hello? I supply only the finest goods. Oh, you sell fruit. Hmm. Tempting. But I think I'll pass. See you now. later. Thanks. I'm just gonna mosey on into your barn here. There's cows and a lady hanging out with some cows. Alright, that's fair. Alright. Uh, not much really the look at in here. Alright. It's just a barn. It's a nice barn. This is really well made. I wonder how much trees had to be chopped down to make this. Alright, let's not put it off for too long. Let's take care of Princess. Such a shame. Although bacon. Alright, let's do this. War? War? Ooh. What was that? The thing came straight at me. Ah, oh, no bacon. Oh well. Alright, well. I don't know why I needed to bring you the collar considering you're standing right there unless your eyesight's really that bad. Hey there. Hi. Princess must die. Yep. Did you see her yet? Yep. Did you get her? Yep. Have a good one. Princess must die. Okay. Thank goodness. That pig was getting so big she'd have eaten our whole crop. Thank oh. you, Embra. You're welcome. Now, do any of these suit you? Um, there's only one, so yeah, I guess. I mean, it's new shoes. I've been stealing see you around. pants. Oh, we're level 8. Yeah. What's the max level you end up getting? I mean, I have to be close to max level, right? Aspect of the turtle. Okay. I get a shield myself. That's a good thing. 
It's also a little disconcerting because why would I need this? Am I going to need to protect myself from something? Well, what is it doing? Oh, whoa! <laughs> look at me, War! I look cool! Says no one ever, but I think I look pretty neat. Alright, let's go do this love letter thing. Hey, yo, dude! I got you a love letter from your girly girl. How are you? Good. Young lovers. You have what? A letter. Mabel is the light of my dull life. Oh. Hurry, let me see her letter. Okay, here you go. See you around. Young lovers. Ah. Uh, I can't stand us being apart. I have to see her. Safe travels. Speak with grandma. Please, Embera, talk with my grandma. If anyone can find a way to bring me together with Mabel, she can. She's inside our house east of here. Yes, I've met her. See you around. Alright, I'll go talk to your grandma. Grandmas are the best. Maybe she has some food. I'm kinda hungry. Hey, Grams. You're not my Grams, Greetings. but... Hi. Speak with Grandma. While our families are feuding, Tommy Joe and Mabel don't have much of a future, but maybe we can get them together for just a little while. Yeah. Um, what can we do? Uh, murder? Go with honor, friend. No to William. Oh. I bet William Pessel has a potion to unite our two young lovers. Oh. Here, take this note to William. Okay. He's staying at the Lion's Pride Inn in Goldshire. Yeah, we've met. Safe travels. Is it a bad thing I just said? You know what, we're gonna ignore the fact that I just said murder was the solution. I literally have no sense of direction. How did I end up back over here with Apple Dude? Ah, but here's a little... What does she call him? Lost necklace. You lost a what? Well, I didn't take no necklace, because I ain't no thief. I might know who did, but, grin, I'm too hungry to remember. Hmm. <laughs> pie for Billy. Maybe if I got a pie, I could tell you who has that necklace. And you know, I think that old Bernice lady at that other farm makes great pork belly pies. <laughs> Maybe if you gave her some tender boar meat from the boars that hang around our farms, and told her what it was for, she'd bake up a pie for you. <laughs> These families feud, and you want me to... You, you took her... You allegedly took her necklace, and the only way for me to get you to tell me is for me to go back and tell that one lady she needs to... ...make you a pie. <laughs> no, yeah, no, yeah. That makes perfect sense. Well, I got the parts for that pie, but that kid's gonna have to wait. Let's go ahead and get some of these quests her. Hmm. All right, so we have what gold dust dude. Hi. Good day to you. How are you? Gold dust exchange. Best. You have that gold dust for me. For me. See you later. Yep. I hear you go. Gold dust exchange. Thanks for the dust, Embra. Here's your cash, and. Here is a token from associates of mine. Oh. You might find it useful. Useful. What associates? Have a good one. Okay. That was weird. A hundred quid. I don't know what that was. Whatever. We're not going to think about it. All right. Hey. King's honor, friend. Be careful. The Fargo Deep Mine. This is bad news. What's next, dragons? We'll Go. have to increase our patrols near that mine. Thanks for your efforts, Embra. Are there dragons? And hold a moment. Oh, okay. I might have another task for you. Okay. For the Alliance. The Jasper Lode Mine. Thanks to you we know the Fargo Deep Mine is infested with kobolds. Now we need a scout to investigate the more distant Jasper Lode Mine. Okay. Explore Jasper Lode and confirm any cobalt presence. Okay. To reach the mine, 
travel east along the road until you reach the Tower of Azura. Okay. From the tower, head north, and you'll find the mine in the foothills. Okay. I'm assuming it'll be Go marked on my map like everything else. Whoa, that's an entourage of... Alliance soldiers. Okay, now let's turn in this letter. Uh, yes, there he is. Hi. Hello. How's it going? Safe travels. Cobalt candles. Did you gather those candles yet? Yup, I sure did. See you around. Cobalt candles. You were busy hunting cobalts, were you? I also Thanks stole for pants. the candles, Embra, and here's your reward. Thank you. Safe travel. Ooh. Note to William. You have. Note to William. Oh. You have a note from Grandma Stonefield. Yes. Yeah. I haven't seen Mildred in years. I wonder what she has to say. Hmm. Have a good one. Note to William. My heart goes out to those two poor souls, Mabel and Tommy Joe. I remember being young and in love, once. Only one. There must be something I can do to help them. Can I hear this Let story? me think. Okay. Bye. See you later. Collecting Cal. I can make an invisibility liquor for Mabel, so oh. she can slip away from the McClure Vineyards and go to Tommy Joe. Oh. But to make the liquor, I need some crystal kelp. Why don't you sell that? Although the kelp usually grows in the ocean, sometimes murlocs collect it. See if the murlocs near Crystal Lake have any. Okay. Crystal Lake is just east of Goldshire. Okay. See you around. Alright, so we're gonna have to deal with the murlocs, huh? Hmm. It's not that far away. I'd rather do that than deal with getting that kid that pie. Even though I got the ingredients for it, I don't think he's gonna starve. Alright. I'm on it, yo. Let's go and... First look in my book. What did I learn? Exhilaration. Hmm. This could be handy. Okay. Hmm. All right. Okay, war. It looks like we got to go figure out what the heck a murloc is. Are you ready? I don't have a target. I can't attack that. How the heck can something so cute be so aggressive? Holy cow! These these murlocs are no joke. Thanks, War. You really had my back back there. Well, now we're on the other side of the river. We might as well go head over to this other mine that we got to go look at. Hmm. Let my heart rate drop down a bit. Oh, I think we're just gonna leave that flat. Ah! Oh, I don't like going after the wolves. Maybe if I just kind of hang out back here? Yes? Okay, back up. Let's go around. Let's not get involved with this. Let's well, not stay too close to the shore either. I don't want another bunch of murlocs coming after me. Alright, here we are. Man, that sounds weird in here. Oh. We're not doing too good. We're gonna have to keep our head on a swivel in here, War. This one, this, this mine. I don't know. I just feel really uneasy being in this one. Let's just 
trying to keep going and see what we see. I need a target. I guess this way. Follow the lanterns. The minecart. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. More! <sighs> Come on. Uh. Oh, shoot. You got it? Oh, behind you. Keep going in. Ooh. Ooh, spider, spider, war. Oh. oh, I do not like this. Do I have to go to the back of this cave? Oh man, there is a lot of cobwebs. Okay, these. These other little ones don't seem to want to bother me, so I just kind of What in the actual fuck? Nope, 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 nope. <gasps> oh my god. Ooh. Oh, breathe. They're not real. They're not real. <sighs> that, we're never going back into a cave war. If that's what's in the back of those things, they can stay there. <sighs> Let's get out of here. You, I don't know what you wanted me to find, but there are spiders in this cave. Greetings. Spiders. They're Be huge. Careful. The Jasper Load Mine. Cobalts at the Jasper Load Mine. And you spiders. Say, yes. Curses. The situation is worsening by the minute. Why are you not worried? Thank you for the report, Embra. You're... But I wish that the news you brought was good news. You're more worried about cobalts than giant spiders that are bigger than me? Life bless you. All right. For the Alliance. Sure. Westbrook Garrison needs help. Yeah. The garrison on our western border sends word of increasing knoll and thief activity. Okay. They're requesting we send more Stormwind soldiers, but we just don't have any to spare. If you can help, we could use it. Go and speak with Deputy Rayner at the Westbrook garrison and see what he needs done. The garrison is down the road to the west. After you cross the bridge over the small brook it will be to the right. Okay. So, Light bless you. We're, we're just not even going to talk about the fact that there's giant spiders. Seems fair. Alright. Alright, so... Knolls and cobalts are more of a big deal than giants. They don't care, okay? I guess I shouldn't either. Fine, we'll just drop it. We'll you just drop need it. something? Yeah. Collecting kelp. 
probably Do you tequila. have that crystal kelp? Yeah. I'm sure Mabel is anxious to see her bow. Yeah. Safe travels. Collecting kelp. You got them. Good show. Now, just one moment while I concoct the potion. Yeah. See you later. You wouldn't happen to have like hard liquor, would you? No. Good day to you. All right. The escape. Take this invisibility liquor to young Mabel. It should last long enough for her to visit Tommy Joe. Okay. Have a good one. <sighs> well, at least I'm not murdering anybody at the moment. All right, let's go. All right, Mabel, I got you something to drink. I've been hey promised is medically safe. Did you deliver my letter to Tommy Joe? I did. What did he say? I don't remember. See you later. The escape. Oh, my. I feel guilty deceiving my family, but my feelings for Tommy Joe are too strong to ignore. Okay. Thank you, Embra. You're welcome. I'll drink this liquor as soon as I have the chance and sneak away to my love. Okay. And for you, please take this. Oh. Safe travels. Thanks. What the heck? Uh. What was that? Who is that? Hello? Did did I just glitch? What what just happened? I don't know who that was back there, but I Thirst told me to avoid other people because they can't be trusted. I'm I lost something glitched and now I I don't have my crossbow anymore. I got it. Oh. Sure. Why not? Let you know, let's just make this a little bit more difficult if it hasn't been already. All right. So what is it that we need to be doing next war? Oh, there's a bear. Oh no. Oh no. War. Ooh, nice job war. Oh. It's my little baby boy. Good job. Dang, did you get stronger? Heck, all right. Okay, so what was I needing to do? I think it was something about having to make a pie for a kid that stole the necklace. Potentially, allegedly, you know, not, not guilty and proven guilty, so... Yeah. How are you? Eh, fine. Pie for Billy. Yeah. I don't think it's right feeding the boy who stole my necklace in the first place, but if that's what it takes to get back what's mine, then so be it. Do you have that boar meat? Yes, I do. See you around. Pie for Billy. Though this wild boar meat is bland, simmer it enough in the right spices and it sure does make for some tasty pie. Really? Have a good one. Back to Billy. Here you go. And when you give this pie to that Billy, you tell him I hope he chokes on it. <laughs> Safe travels. You didn't poison it, did you? You know what? If you did, that's not my issue. I'm just delivering stuff. All right, little dude. I have a maybe not so poison pie. Back to Billy. Pie. Ugh. I'm starving. Okay. Do you have that pie for me, Embra? So needy. Back to Billy. MM, yum. This pie is the best. I think my memory is coming back to me. Well, that's good. Gold tooth. I was playing near the Fargo Deep Mine, and I think I dropped, ER, I mean I saw, the old lady's necklace. Okay. Don't ask me how it got there, it wasn't me. Sure. Well anyway, I saw this big. Gold toothed cobalt pick up the necklace and run back to his den above the mine. Go find that cobalt and you'll find the necklace, I swear. Alright, I mean like, next time though, I'm pretty sure this lady is gonna poison food for you. So I mean, you might want to just like, keep that in mind. Alright, so we gotta go get a cobalt. 
He said above the mine that kind of looks like the right direction war. Let's see. Maybe up here? Yep, there he is. Oh! I need a target. Oh, I don't really know how I feel about hitting things. I like the idea of being farther back, but I guess this is what this is. Alright, let's go, war. You bite him, I'll smack him. Whoa! Did you see that? I just pulled out a hip crossbow. Alright. I'm not mad about this anymore. That was pretty cool. Um, yeah, I don't think we're gonna go that way. Alright, so we gotta go around and let's get this lady back her necklace. Alright, lady. I got your necklace here you in my hand. You need something? Gold tooth. Hello, Embra. Have you found my necklace? I have. See you around. Gold tooth. Oh, you found it? Thank you. Thank you, dear. Here, take this. It was my husband's and he always said it was lucky. If only he didn't forget it on his last campaign. Sniff. Oh man. Um thank you for the oven. See you mitts. later. I will treasure these oven mitts. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm uh, I, I think I'm just going to go ahead and head on out. Thanks again for the oven. Mitts. Sorry about your husband. Bye. Ooh, that was a little awkward. I don't know what to say in situations like that. I mean, like, why? Why would you give a complete stranger your 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 deceased husband's oven mitts? <laughs> I don't mean to laugh. Oh god. <laughs> I really am a terrible person. <laughs> All right, War, before we keep going on, let's go head back into the inn, get some lunch, kind of take a small little break, and then we will get back into today. Oh, I wonder how long I've been doing this. All right, we are full fed and ready to go. Now, if I'm not mistaken, he said that I could borrow a horse. I don't really have a lot of experience with horses. What can I do for you? Hey, I just ate, but is it okay if I'm on a horse? It'll go slow, right? I don't want to puke. Be careful. Whoa, 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 whoa. I... Oh, I'm not really sure about this. It seems to be on autopilot. Oh, run faster. Ooh. Okay. Oof. Oof. Alright, this isn't so bad. I mean, I have no control over where this thing's going, so it's just it's just like being at an amusement park on a roller coaster ride. It's not so bad. It's being very stable, sure footed, trust the system. Just trust the process. It'll be fine. This isn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. A lot faster, I will admit that. I wonder where war went. He just disappeared? Well, I'm sure he'll show back up. He does that sometimes. This looks like the place. Uh, yeehaw, stop. Whoa. Okay. Oh, what the? Uh, ghost horse. All right. Sure. <sighs> Need help? Mentally, yes. But that's not what you meant. For the Alliance. Further concerns. Yes, 
Murlocs have settled in and around the streams of eastern Elwyn. Yep. We don't know why they are here, but they are aggressive and at least semi-intelligent. They're also adorable. Life bless you. Find the lost guards. A few days ago we sent two guards, Rolf and Malachi, to investigate along the river, and they have not yet returned. Oh. To complete my report, I must know what happened to those men. Travel north along the river and find the guards, or their remains. Maybe they just want alone time. Go with honor, friend. Protect nope. the frontier. Okay. Hail, Embra. Hi. Wild animals are growing more and more aggressive the farther we get from Goldshire, and the Eastvale logging camp suffers nearly constant attacks from wolves and bears. Well, it is the woods. We could use your help out here. I mean... Be careful. Yeah. Why am I not surprised you want me to murder more things? Alright, what else we got? Bounty on Murlocs. The Stormwind army has placed a bounty on Murloc lurkers and foragers in Elwyn. No. Slaughter them and bring Guard Thomas their torn Murloc fins, and the Stormwind army will reward you well. Okay. The Murlocs have built a village at Stone Cairn Lake north of here, and another to the south where the stream forks. Well, this is lucky, I'm heading that way. Wanted, James Clark. Who? By decree of the Stormwind Army, a bounty has been placed on the head of James Clark. Clark is wanted for robbery, burglary, arson, and murder. Oh. He is also a suspect in the kidnapping and disappearance of the Brackwell's prized pig, Princess. Oh. James Clark was last seen heading towards Eastvale Logging Camp. Bring James Clark to justice and report to Marshal Patterson at Eastvale Logging Camp. Princess? Oh no. Princess must die. The Brackwells have a prize-winning pig, Princess. The sow is huge, and she got that way from sneaking over here and eating my veggies. It just so happens that she's here now. Princess must die. Bring me. Did you see her yet? Did you get her? Thank goodness. That pig was getting so big she'd have eaten our whole crop. Thank you, Embra. Ah, oh, shit. Well, I think it's time for me to go ahead and head on out. Yeah, we're not gonna talk about this. Who would have thought the consequences had actions in this game? Actions had consequences? You know what I mean, War. Don't judge me. Alright, let's go ahead and see what we can figure out about these murlocs and these missing dudes. I'm pretty sure they are just chilling and relaxing. They're probably fishing. I mean, I'm not sure why they're so worried about the fact that two guards go missing. Is that is that so weird? Is it? War? Uh, I miss talking to Thirst. At least he actually talks back and I don't feel like I'm going insane. We might have to make a detour at some point in time to store one to go see him. What's that up there? No, don't try to eat it, War. Leave it. Find the Lost Guards. Although much has been stripped from the corpse, Strewn nearby is a medallion with the words, Footman Malachi Stone etched upon it. Ew, gross. Discover Rolf's fate. Upon further searching the area, you find webbed footprints leading east along the shore of Stone Cairn Lake. In the distance to the east, you can just barely see a murloc village. Perhaps Rolf's fate ended there. Well... Real or not, this is definitely the first dead body I've ever seen. Well, technically, no, that's not right. I've killed a lot of people. Uh, no. They weren't human. No. Have I? Hmm. I'm not so sure anymore. Have I actually killed a human in this game yet? I mean, are they really human? I mean, it's a video game, right? Hmm. 
Well, needless to say, there's the village. And there are murlocs. All right, you remember from the last encounter, slow and steady. Whoa, what? You see that? He healed himself. They can do that? Ugh. Oh, this is... This is just fantastic. No, oh, watch out, war. I'm out of range. Ah! Stupid stick can't reach. I'm the biggest stick. <sighs> You're right, war. Why does it have to be murlocs? They're so cute, yet so vicious. Oh, let's just get this done with. Hmm, it looks like that might be another dead body up there. <sighs> Alright, let's do this. Discover Rolf's fate. Ah, crap. You Lord. find around the neck of the corpse a metal medallion inscribed with the words, Footman Rolf Hartford. <sighs> Report to Thomas. Now that you have both medallions, deliver them to guard Thomas at the bridge so that he might know the fate of his murdered guards. Um. Oh, let's get out of here. Oh, you got that war? Alright. Well, I was hoping these guys were just fishing, but... Mm, it looks like maybe the murlocs were fishing with them. I don't know. What the hell is that sound? Oh, what is this? Welcome to your specialization and talent menu, where every time you level, a new point is given to you. You are able to put these points into new skills and abilities. Oh. Well, that's pretty darn handy, isn't it? Alright, well... Uh, looks like we got a new skill, kiddo. Whether that's good or not, no clue. I'm gonna have to ask Thirst the next time we talk to him about this specialization and talent system. He'll probably know more. I'm guessing this is the logging camp they're talking about. I can see why animals are encroaching on this. They literally are in their territory. This is your fault, not theirs. Now let's go ahead and head in here and see what we can do. I also think that James Clark guy might be in here. Oh, we're gonna have to deal with that. I see you there, Griffin Master, and the answer is nope. We're just not even gonna bother right with that. Oh. King's Sounds honor, friend. Different. A bundle of trouble. I've got a real problem on my hands. Oh. Okay. I have a deadline looming for an order of lumber, and I'm running out of time. Mm. The wolves and bears north of here have chased my workers away from the bundles of wood that they've already chopped. It kind of sounds like I've a already problem. talked to Deputy Rainer about clearing the animals, but I need someone to go collect the wood for me. Okay. If you could collect eight bundles of wood for me, I might just make my deadline. So I'm expendable to you. Gotcha. Farewell. Yeah, I'll get right on that. I'll go grab your wood. Ready to work. Hmm. Why do these guys sound different than everybody All else? Alright. Off I go then. Huh. That's weird. But okay. Hmm, it looks like that cabin on the right might be the one we have to go to, but let's go ahead and talk to this lady first. Hmm. Light be with you. Uh, fine linen goods. The thugs in Elwyn wear linen which I can use to make fine linen goods. What? Bring me linen scraps and I'll use them to fashion something for you. You'll find those lawless criminals in pockets across Elwyn Forest. 
You want me to kill some people so I can steal their clothes so you can make me something out of it. Light bless you. Yeah, no, that... That makes... That makes no... Oh, sure. Alright, alright, you know. You're right. You're right. I'm just gonna poke inside, see what's going on in your what cabin. What can I do for you? Um... Nothing. See I guess. you later. Yep, bye. Um... Man. All right. We just have to convince him. Let's just not even mention it. Let's not mention the fact that I killed Princess. We're just not going to bring it up. Oh, man. His kids are inside. Oh. oh. James Clark. Hey, buddy, do you want to, like, step outside, maybe, so we can talk about this? Or... Or are you just going to kind of... I'm going to I'm gonna peek in your book first, The pages okay? of the journal seem to be filled with information about trades, buyers, and other miscellaneous business-related events. That's not really helpful, but okay. No... Kevin, Kyle, I'm going to need you guys to, like, cover your eyes and close your ears. I got to talk to your dad? Question mark? Sure. All right, war. Let's get this over with. Oh, why am I taking his head? Oh, that's so gross. You. The Collector. This note is a schedule with a list of days and times when a person described only as the Collector will receive a shipment of gold from the mines in Elwyn Forest. Oh, his head is leaking. From the schedule, it looks as if the Collector resides near the Brackwell Pumpkin Patch in eastern Elwyn. What? This sounds important. You should report it to Marshall Patterson at Eastvale Logging Camp. Oh, dude. I get the fact that this is a game and he just spawned back in, so clearly it's fine. I did not make orphans or anything else like that, but I got your dripping head in my bag. That is really, truly disgusting. Oh, what's wrong with these people? Ugh. Gross. Let's just get this over with. I got a head in my bag. Can I just give that to you? What can I do for you? Take this head. It's gross. Go with honor, friend. Wanted. James Clark. Turning in a bounty? Yeah. For the Alliance. Wanted. James Clark. And justice is served. What are you gonna do with the head? Be careful. The Collector. Oh. What? We haven't had our people working the Elwyn mines for months. Let me see that note you have. Well, what are you doing with Go the with head? Go with honor, friend. The Collector. Are you... Um, uh, I have heard of this Collector, but I don't know whom he's working for. We're just not going to discuss it? Thank you it? for the schedule. Uh, it welcome? will help us solve this mystery. Okay. Be careful. Manhunt. If the Collector is taking gold from our minds, then he's stealing from the kingdom. Bring the Collector to justice, and bring me the ring mentioned in the pickup schedule you gave me. Okay. It may tell us whom the Collector is working for. Okay. That pickup schedule says the collector is hiding out at the Brackwell Pumpkin Patch. Why'd you want his head? You should search for him there. Oh. Light bless you. Are we just not going to talk about the fact that I just gave you a severed head and I'm going to have to wash out my bags and... Oh. oh. Hi. Good to you. Hello. Continue to Stormwind. For a small fee, you can take a griffin to Stormwind so you can deliver Argus note to Uzric. No. You won't get there faster any other way. No, I'll walk. If that sounds acceptable, then just speak to me again when you're ready for the ride. No. I'll charge you a little, but trust me, it'll be worth it. How about I just puke on your shoes now? See you around. Oh my god. <sighs> I'm gonna have to find that stream and wash out my bag. It smells... Oh, this is gross. No, they're giant spiders, severed heads. I'm a murderer. I kill so many people. 
I am a hundred percent the bad guy. I'm not a terrible person, but this game makes me a terrible person. I'm not okay. War. I am not okay. <sighs> I'm gonna have to take some time off after this. I had a long cry while I was out in the forest. Here is your stupid wood. You need something? Take it. A bundle of trouble. That deadline isn't getting any further away. And that's Hunter. your fault, not mine. Please hurry and collect those bundles of wood. See, this is gaslighting. Your issue is not my issue. A bundle of trouble. Excellent. Yeah? Thanks to you, no I should word. be able to complete the order in time. You're welcome. To show my gratitude, I would like I to I offer can. some coin as compensation for your troubles. I'll take that. Thank you and farewell. Safe travels. And farewell to you too. All right, so now where are we going? Let's see here. It looks like... I don't even remember what I'm doing. I'm still traumatized from that stupid head. All right, I gotta get linen scraps. That's what it is. I gotta go after... I have to go after people... I gotta kill people to take their clothes so she can make me something out of their clothes. That seems so morbidly wrong. Here, let's get these turned into well really quickly. Hello? For the Alliance. Report to Thomas. Ah. Uh, Hello, Embra. Hi. Hi. Have you discovered the fates of Rolf and Malachi? Yeah! Life bless you. About that. Report to Thomas. You have confirmed my fears. Embra. I'm sorry. The Murlocs are a threat we cannot ignore. Um. Go with honor, friend. Cloth and leather armor. For your shrewdness and valor, I have a marker here that is good for one piece of armor. I want you to take it to Sarah Timberlane at the East Vale logging camp. Yeah, I've met her. Give her the marker, and she will fashion the armor for you. Okay. And after you receive it, yeah. Embra, yeah. use it in the defense of Elwyn. Okay. East Vale is just east of this post across the bridge. Yeah, I stumbled across there. For the Alliance. Be careful. Bounty on Murlocs. How goes the hunting, Embra? It was alright. Bless you. Bounty on Murlocs. You have the fins. Great. Marshal Dugan is anxious about the Murloc situation in Eastern Elwyn. Um, and I'd like to tell him that it's becoming under control. What are we doing? Your actions have helped realize that. With the fins. Are you gonna, like, make jewelry or, like, soup or something? You know what? I'm just gonna take this pitchfork as a reward. For the Alliance. Protect the frontier. Okay. Thanks a lot for the help, Embra. You're welcome. Something in the forest must be making these animals so bold. Um. Whatever it is. I hope it stays there. You're encroaching on their Careful. territory. That's, it's like deforestation 101, but I'm, I'm no expert on that, but you know, it's just go into the woods, you're gonna run into a bear kind of thing. But you know, regardless of that, I got a level, which means I got a new point I can play with. Let's see here. Ooh, there's a lot of options. Oh, I don't, I don't know what's good about any of these, really. I guess we're just gonna have to kind of feel it out, perhaps? I mean, we can daze people, but I don't have a bow. Um, this doesn't seem bad. This, this doesn't seem too bad either. Hmm... What do you think, War? I'm honestly not sure what I should be picking. Eh, this looks good. Alright, that is finished. Let's go murder some people and steal their clothes. I'm starting to think it's not really murder, it's more like I'm a mercenary for hire. So these people had it coming to them regardless, I'm just the tool they're using for the job, I suppose. You got it, War? Nice, let's get this lady. I think you have a key for me. Ring. Ring, not a key, sorry. Key ring? 
Uh, sure. All right. All right. Couple more scraps of fabric and we can go and get this done. All right, let's finish this war. And I think I might see our next potential victim. Hmm. Eh, she's closer. Okay, I got all the necessary well things met. that you have required. Go with honor, friend. Cloth and leather armor. I have been commissioned by the Stormwind Army to supply their people with cloth and leather armor. If you have a marker for me, then I'd be happy to make you something. I technically wear a male, but I mean... Well. Cloth and leather armor. Ah, thank you for the marker. Please feel free to oh. pick your choice of armor. Luck to you, brave hunter. And may this armor serve you well. I will take some new pants. Go with honor, friend. Fine linen goods. I'm running low on linen, Embra. Do you have any for me? Yeah. Be careful. Fine linen goods. Ah, these are nice scraps, if a little rough. Hey. Here you are. I did my best. Light bless you. All right. Thanks for the gear. I appreciate it. It's kind of a pain to go get, but I mean, thank you nonetheless. All right, let's give this dude the ring. The one ring to rule them all. Although I don't think that... I hope not. God, I don't want to touch that. Ew. Need help? Always. Manhunt. Did you find the collector? I did. Did you discover whom he's working for? Mm, yeah, yes. Kind of. Go with honor, friend. Manhunt. You found him. Well done. Embra. Thanks. He won't be collecting from the Elwyn mines again. And this ring you found is interesting. It's a membership oh, ring for the old stonemasons guild in Stormwind. Oh. I haven't seen one of these in years, since oh, back in the days when the Defias Brotherhood used to infest this land. I'm still not sure who the Defias Brotherhood is, but okay. For the Alliance. I'm sure I'll figure it out at some point in time what you're talking about, but I'm glad I could help. All right, so what do we have next that we gotta be looking at? Let's see here. All right, let's look at the map really quickly. My next quest is on the other side of the Elwyn Forest. Oh, that is such a long walk. Oh, that is gonna take me forever to get there. More work. I mean, I could take a griffin. Right no. No, I'm not that desperate. You know what? I don't mind getting my steps. And granted, I don't have a Fitbit in this world, but... I'm not opposed to walking. I mean... I could fly. Nah, fuck it, I'll walk. I can't believe it's been this long since I've been in Stormwind. Uh, what, a month? No. Has it? Time seems to just bleed together here. I think I spent way too much time in Goldshire just trying to recover from that severed head incident. Well, let's go see if we can find Thirst and maybe ask him some questions. Oh, there he is, just up ahead. Hey, Thirst! Hey, princess. Why do you always call me that? Because you act like you are a bit too entitled. I'm... I'm... You don't have to be so honest. <laughs> I told you I would never lie to you. I mean, that's true. You said you'd never lie to me, but I also didn't think you'd be so brutally honest about it. I mean, I always kind of assumed you called me princess because you thought I was pretty, but I mean... You know. Is that what you want me to say to you? Because I can, and I still would be telling you the truth. <laughs> Shut up. You like that? I'm not answering that. 
What can I do for you? I have questions about stuff that I now have access to. Oh, you reached level 10, that's good. You are ready to move on to the next part of the game. Wait, what do you mean the next part of the game? There's more? You may have noticed by now that I am pretty invested in you, and if you win the game, you will need to get a character description. It's going to bind us together, story-wise, that is. What do you mean, bind us together? What does that even mean? Don't freak out. What do you mean, don't freak out? Look, all new people that get brought into the game get a sponsor, so to speak. So to speak? What do you mean? It's not called that specifically. Look, I get it that you want to try to gentle the blow to me for a lot of the crap that is going on right now, but rip the band-aid off, just lay it out there flat. What is it? A sponsor is a nicer way of saying what it's officially called here. A dominant and a submissive. What? Who the hell created this environment? What the fuck? And I guess that means that you're qualified to be this said person? I am qualified because I have been here for a long time and I understand the consequences of not being able to adapt. What is there even to adapt to at this point? You just pretty... I have lost people, and I won't lose you too. I get that. But you gotta understand what you're asking me to do. I... I... I don't know what to say. It's all part of the game. I will tell you where you need to go. Only you can decide what you want to do. That is true. But I know what I would like you to do. Oh, and don't try to fight the urge to sleep. It's going to happen regardless. What do you think, War? I don't know what I'm supposed to do at this point. I mean, being bound to somebody... Is it really that big of a deal when it's not reality? I mean, nothing in here is real, right? But why do I feel like this is such a huge, important decision to make? Like, there's no going back after this. We'll make our way over to the location and then decide if we'll go in or not. Well, this looks like this is the place. <sighs> Screw it, let's do this. What do I got to lose? I'm already stuck in here and Thirst is not the worst person to be stuck with, so let's do this. Hello? Is anybody there? Boy, this area doesn't look quite right. Oh, why do I feel so sleepy? War, I, I think I'm gonna pass out. Oh. What happened, War? Oh, my head. Oh, this feels just like what happened when I woke up in here. Oh. What is going on? Why is it so dark? Wait, what time is it? How long have I been passed out? the hell oh my it's already night time what what happened war oh I really wish you could tell me what's this it looks like I got something next to my mini map 
total RP3? What is that? Okay, so... Ember Ravenswood. Human. Mercenary. Tracker. Not sure what that is. Young adult. Hazel eyes. Short for a human? I'm not that short. Curvy. Okay. Birthplace. Stormwind. I live in Stormwind. Nickname. Princess. Employer? The organization? Who's that? Thirst hasn't mentioned anything like that. Tattoos? What? My left forearm bears a stylized scythe with razor-sharp edges that seem to gleam with an ominous aura surrounded surrounding the scythe. Dark swirling shadows coil and wraith. Within these shadows, a symbol is faintly discernible. I think that's what that word is. A stylized letter B? What the hell? What? All right, I got a tattoo and it was painless. Okay, that's not the worst thing ever. It just goes with the rest of my tattoos, but... What's with the letter B? Wait, there's more? What does this say? Embra, a survival hunter from the wilds of Elwyn Forest, navigates the dangers of Azeroth with her loyal wolf war by her side. Trained to survive and trust no one, she is haunted by the sense of displacement as if her, as if her reality is but a shadow of something else. Stormwind, the heart of human civilization, feels oddly foreign to her. The city's grandeur and familiar faces and the bustling markets should be home. Yet Ambra is haunted by an unshakable sense of displacement. Her instinct screamed that this reality is not what it seems, compelling her to embark on a quest for truth. Trust does not come easily to Ambra. Her guarded nature is a shield forged from past betrayals and an enigmatic past she barely remembers. In this world, secrecy is survival and revealing too much could be her undoing. Enter Thirst, a stormwind guard with a mysterious aura and eyes that seem to pierce through her soul. What? Drawn to him despite her instincts to stay wary, Ember finds herself caught in a dance of suspense and attraction? What? Thirst's intentions are cloaked in shadows and every interaction with him leaves her questioning his true motives. What? Oh, I need to find him. What the hell? I mean, sure, we flirted a little bit and there was that one time, but we're not talking about that. Why? What? I just need to find him. Thirst! There you are. I've been looking for you. Hey, uh, we need to talk. Hey, princess. Did you enjoy your nap? No. Why does my character description say that I'm attracted to you? Well, there was that one time when you first got here. Is that the only thing you are upset about? I told you in detail what it meant to go through with this. That I would be your sponsor. The fact that they added those other little details is because they see everything. So don't act so surprised when the truth is written out. Wait, who are they? Is that the organization it says I work for? They are the people that run the game. Who they are exactly is unknown. The organization, however, is a completely different beast. The organization is the underbelly of this game, the dark shadows, and the people that are stuck like you. But they have been here longer than you have, and believe me when I say this, you don't fuck with them. You do the jobs they give you and say thank you for it. Am I in danger? No, not really. As long as you have my mark on your arm, you will be fine. Well, I do appreciate the new tattoo, why is your symbol a scythe in the letter B? It's a scythe because I kill people. Some people would say that I am not a good person. Truth is, I am not a good person, but for some reason, I seem to care about you, princess. Why? And the letter B? Does that stand for bloodthirst? No, the B is for Bastion. Bastion? My real name. Oh. You just told me your real name. Why would... 
I, I don't understand. Look, I am almost off work. Come over and stay a few nights. We can talk and I will answer all your questions. As tempting as that is, I have quests I need to do and levels to get. Your quests are not going anywhere. They will still be there in a few days. That's the beauty of being in a video game. True, but I'm not sure. Look, I am making undermined clam chowder for dinner tonight. You know where the key is. Let yourself in, and I will see you when I get home. I could eat. Thank you.